Hey, that one. This might be the right one. The Fishing Public Channel is all about showing local fishermen and fishermen from all over what is possible here on the Gulf Coast. We fish out of Dolphin Island, Alabama. Looking very white. Big old scam. Big old oh. nice. Yellow edge. I mean yellow edge. Oh, yellow edge. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it wasn't very brown, the bottom of it. Can you get some video of it? Oh wow. Awesome. There we go. You got him? <laughs> Double up on the yellow edge. Oh no, he was hooked in the bone. Look at that. You beat me on size. Mine's a little bigger. Hold that one up there. Talk. Oh. Manual G. <laughs> As opposed to electric. Sometimes you just gotta go old school. <laughs> Caught mine on the. Oh shit. On the new Jig Pro 400 gram. Joey sure got his on. Oh, I don't even know. No telling. Secret. <laughs> but mine. Oh yeah. All right, <laughs> nice one. Show them the box. <laughs> it's turning brown. All right guys, so these next few clips we lost audio on somehow, the GoPro messed up. But right here you can see Captain Bo, he just pulled up a yellow edge grouper. We're fishing in about 400 feet of water southwest of Dolphin Island. We headed over to the lump, try and catch some tuna that morning, but tuna weren't biting. There were about six other boats there. All six boats were trolling. So we stayed there for about an hour, scouted it out. Didn't see anything happening. So we moved back towards the east and hit this pipeline crossing. At this particular crossing, there were about two other crossings within a hundred yards of this one. So we ended up pulling six yellow edge off of this one crossing. Right here you can see Captain Bo and our guest from Georgia just pulled up two yellow edge grouper about eight to ten pounds. Bo caught his on a JYG deeper, the pink and silver. And the other jig we used was a black dog. You can see it right there. Now Bo's using his new rod, he got, it's called a Witch Doctor, it's made by Witch Doctor Tackle, the Pandemic, it's an 8 foot 6, one piece spiral wrap, he bought it from Johnny Jigs, he went down to South Florida and stopped by Johnny Jigs on the way and picked up this rod from the man John himself. So make sure to check out Johnny Jigs, all the videos you see of us catching sea bass is on their jig and majority of the grouper we catch are on their jigs. So definitely make sure to go check them out if you haven't. 
right here, Bill caught another yellow edge on a 450 HR. The link to that jig is in the description. It's the pink and silver with glow and silver on the back side. We got Joey, Captain Cuz, hooked up in this corner. He, he was hooked up to a good fish and then got sharked. So now he's just trying to break the shark off and lose a $20 jig, which is just something you have to do when you're slow pitch jigging. Now over here we got, we got another double up, another yellow edge grouper. The black dog seemed to do the best on this day. It's a, I believe it's a 400 gram jig. I'll have to find it, but I'll definitely link it in the description. It was the orange and silver colorway. Miss the gaff. <laughs> But two more yellow edges about the same size in that eight pound range. Definitely get some good fillets off of those. So now we got our other guest with us. His name is Johnny. He's pulling up a nice scamp. He caught it on a 250 ground jig that none of us have ever seen. It's from Bass Pro. And it literally has a B-liner printed on the side of it. I'm about to show you a close-up of it. So right here you can see the jig that he's using. Get a good close up of that B liner. <laughs> now, right here, Johnny caught a 20 pound snapper on the Boca grips. It weighed 22 pounds, so you can give or take a couple. Those Boca grips, you never know how accurate they are. But we vented this fish and released it back. But thank you guys for watching today's video. Make sure to check us out on Instagram at the fishing public underscore. Make sure to subscribe and share with your friends. It'll help us out a lot. We're going to give away a trip once we hit a thousand subscribers. Like you see in all of our videos, slow pitch jigging. Catching grouper, sea bass, amberjack, red snapper. Everything you could imagine on a slow pitch jig. But make sure to check out Johnny Jigs and Jig Pro. Those are the two biggest companies that we get most of our jigs from. They make the best jigs. They are expensive, but it's worth the money. But until next time, we'll see you on the water.